Welcome to Dark Horizon Creations. I'm Mike, and today I've got a very special video review for all of you Halo fans. We're taking a look at Drome 092 from Halo the Spartan Collection Series 2 by Wicked Cool Toys. Now, Jerome is the final figure in Series 2 as we await Series 3 to be uh, released this fall. Now, if you haven't already, please follow, like, and subscribe to our uh, social media accounts on Facebook, Instagram, and our YouTube channel. We're up to 261 subscribers and counting. Be sure to hit that bell icon so you get a notification of when I post uh, new content. In my opinion, Jerome is probably in the top three fan favorite characters in the Halo franchise. Uh, next to John and Cortana. Jerome, of course, uh, is made famous by Halo Wars and Halo Wars 2. He's also in, in other content. For those of you that don't know anything about him, uh, he was actually born under the name Jerome Cable. Uh, he's one of uh, the few Spartans that we actually know their last name, and I think the only Spartan in the Spartan 2 program that we actually know his full name. I could be mistaken, but I think he is. He was actually born on 8 May 2511 to a very poor family in the uh, Palacos Borderlands region on the colony planet of Minister. And even as a young child, he was always getting into trouble, breaking the law, getting into mischief. Uh, he had a very violent side to his, his personality. And he was uh, conscripted into the Spartan II program and, of course, sent to the planet Reach. During his time on Reach, uh, early on, he made several attempts to escape from the uh, Spartan II compound there. Each time, he turned around and came back. And Dr. Halsey and, and Chief Mendez singled him out, along with Kurt, Fred, and John, as uh, one of the top four candidates uh, to become leaders in the Spartan II program. After their augmentation, uh, Jerome was given command of Red Team. They participated in the Battle of Arcadia, which led to the events uh, of Halo Wars and, of course, Halo Wars 2. Jerome was originally uh, commissioned as a uh, petty officer uh, and then promoted to senior chief petty officer. And, of course, uh, Captain Cutter promoted him to commander. Uh, so he actually outranks John. Uh, John uh, is what we would call a non-commissioned officer, uh, and Jerome is actually a commissioned officer. So he's also actually taller than John as well by one inch uh, in their armor. He's seven foot three inches tall, and John is seven foot two inches tall. Uh, so he's a very unique character. You know, his personality is the opposite of John, where John is very insular and introverted, uh, you know, very reserved, only speaks when he has to. Uh, Jerome is very outspoken. You know, he's not afraid to speak his mind. Uh, he has a very dry sense of humor. And he has a more relaxed approach to dealing with those immediately around him, uh, particularly team members and, and shipmates and things on board the Spirit of Fire. So he's a very cool character. I really like him. Now, like all of the uh, figures in the Halo Spartan collection, uh, you can see these figures are packaged in a really nice display box. Um, minimum uh, marketing promotional material around the borders, like the Halo logo, Spartan collection, uh, wording and uh, the character's name at the top on the banner. On the side panel, you have a picture of Jerome. Down at the bottom, the original UNSC logo. And on the back, your obligatory product shots of all the figures in Series 2. Uh, Jerome, of course, includes the M90 shotgun and the M6G Magnum pistol and five additional hands. What we're going to do now is pause the video, remove him from the packaging, all right, guys, we're back with Spartan Jerome from Halo, the Spartan Collection Series 2. And as you can see, this is a really, really nice looking figure. I like the way he looks better than the Master Chief. And both of them are in, you know, uh, Mark IV Mjolnir armor. Uh, his just has a different aesthetic and design to it. You can also see he's got a red command stripe there on his right chest. And on his right shoulder armor... He has a Corinthian helmet painted, uh, which was also used by the Spartans in Greece. So that's that's really cool. Uh, I really like the way that Jerome looks. Now, if you guys are curious about the height of the action figure, Jerome is a little over seven inches in height. <clears throat> 
Really nice detailing all the way around. Just a really, really cool figure. You guys can see that. Um, his armor has so many details in it. It's just wild. I really like the way this character looks. His head is on a really nice and tight ball joint. Forward and lateral movement there at the shoulder. Bicep rotation. Of course, he's got a butterfly joint, which is designed differently, looks differently than the other figures. Elbow joints nice and tight. Wrist rotation. And his gloves are actually different than the other Spartans. The uh, armor padding and stuff on those are, are already painted. I like that. Ball joint for his torso is really, really tight. Forward and lateral movement there at the thigh and rotation. You can see he's got some detailing weathering painted there. Double jointed knee. Toe joints are tight. Ankles on a nice ball joint is tight as well. Really, really nice action figure. M90 shotgun. Really nice. It's also made out of the soft plastic that the others are. But it's got better paint apps than the other shotguns that I've seen. And uh, it's also for the most part, straight. It's got a little bit of warp into it, but not much. M6 Magnum. Better paint apps than the other ones that I've seen. Really nice looking. Now, let's see, he should have, yes, side panel pulls out here. It's designed different on his armor, it rotates around and M6 Magnum plugs in nicely. This one should also come out, it does. And then on the back, right here, this peg's gonna come out and rotate around. And you can plug a shotgun into his back like so. Really, really cool character. And with these, I always wind up gluing those pegs in because they come out so easily and I don't want to lose them. Now for comparison, I'm going to bring out the Master Chief. Let's see. And you guys can see that, at least I hope you can, the Chief is just a tad shorter, just like he really is in the game. He's still right at seven inches. And Jerome's just slightly taller than he is. Really, really cool. Now that's, that's dedication to get that level of accuracy uh, in an action figure of this scale. That tells me that they actually care what the fans think and, that, and they care about getting the, the little details right. <clears throat> so ladies and gentlemen, there you have Spartan Jerome 092 from Halo the Spartan Collection Series 2. The last figure in Series 2 as we await Series 3 to be unveiled this fall. I hope you guys have enjoyed the video. Stay tuned. There's more to come.